Luzon seed to seed. Luzon or Medicago sativa is a leguminous fodder crop belonging to the family Fabaceae. It is deep rooted and can be grown under rain fed or less irrigated conditions as an annual or a perennial crop. Luzon is a very nutritive fodder and it is rich in protein. The crude protein content is about 20 to 25 percent its dry matter weight. Luzon is also rich in vitamins and has low fiber content. It is termed as queen of forage. Luzon requires deep loamy soils rich in phosphorus, calcium and potash. It also requires a well pulverized and tilled soil. Fine seed bed ensures proper germination. The land should be leveled and made into compartments for uniform irrigation and proper drainage. To get good germination, pre-sowing irrigation is very much essential. Fertilizer application of NPK in the ratio 25 is to 60 is to 40 is given as a basal dose. Sowing is taken up either by broadcasting or line sowing. The seed rate is 20 to 25 kg per hectare for broadcasting and 12 to 15 kg per hectare for line sowing. In line sowing, the rows are kept 30 cm apart. Luzerne, being sensitive to climate, requires cool and dry weather during its seedling growth. For successful establishment of the crop, Frequent irrigations are given a 10 days interval. Weeding and hoeing operations are very much essential during its early stages of growth. It could be done manually or by using machines to pull out the weeds. Harvesting of the green fodder starts from 55th to 65th day after sowing. Green fodder yield is 80 to 90 tonnes per hectare. When the first cutting is done, the subsequent cuttings can be done at an interval of 30 days. The plants start to regenerate from the stubbles. Mild and hot, dry conditions favor the vegetative growth of the plant. Luzon hay is used mostly for the horses, while dehydrated luzon is milled to get meals for the poultry. For the seed production of luzon, the plant is allowed to flower. Flowering Initiation Luzon, being a cross-pollinated crop, has its flowers containing volatile compounds that attracts pollinators like bees and butterflies. These pollinators influence the seed sets in Luzon. The flower has three different types of petals, namely the standard, wing and the keel petal. After the pollination by the pollinators, the pods begin to form. The pods formed are initially green in color. The green pods are allowed to mature. The mature pods turn to brown in color. The crop does not mature at the same time and hence harvesting is done over a long period. The ear heads are collected during the early hours of the day. Seeds are obtained by processing the dried pods. Processing can be done manually or by using seed processors. By manual way, the pods are crushed using the palms. Broken pods are blown off to get the seeds. The seed yield ranges about 260 to 280 kg per hectare depending upon the variety. This is the seed production of Luzerne. Thank you.